This is DJ Max Technica Q. It's a free app、um, that comes with four free songs plus three more you can unlock. I unlocked these two just by writing a review, which I didn't even do, and、uh, play six songs and you unlock one more. And so I'll just jump in here. So I'm going to choose three lines. You can also choose two lines. And then there's some items you can choose, some effects that actually make the game harder.、Uh, but there are some achievements for those. So we have hold notes. And then there are some follow notes. And there's actually like five or six different types. And another interesting thing is that this actually uses key sounds. So if I play off the beat, like I'll just kind of、uh, like, see, like if I kind of rush this, it'll actually sound bad because it's actually playing it the speed that I'm playing it. Which kind of makes it hard if you don't know the song, which I, I you know, I, I've never heard these songs before except in this game. So it's hard to like, figure out the rhythm if you don't know what it's supposed to be. So these purple ones I have to tap at the beginning and then wherever there's a line. So in this case, it's just twice. You can see it gets pretty difficult, like tangling your arms up. With the key sounds that each song contains and the music videos or animations in the background, this app is actually two gigabytes in size, and I haven't bought any extra songs. And I assume that's just for the songs that it comes with here. So it is a huge app, and probably extra songs are just going to take up as much space. So I'm going to be deleting this very soon after I finish this video. Um, but if you are interested in more songs, you have max points up here and Q points, and you can shop and buy max.、Uh, you can buy max points or you can buy Q points. Q points for 60 points is $6, and if we look at music packs, the music packs cost 60 Q. So $6 for four songs. Or a little bit cheaper if you buy a lot more Q points at once. So it's a little expensive. Kind of makes sense with music videos and key sounds and everything.、Um, there's also some other like, power ups and things. You can have characters misspelled on here.、Uh, and then there are all these achievements where you can earn max points. So you get like 35, 50 points if you do these quests. I got five points for each of these just for clearing a song. I earned 20 Q points from playing, but I don't think I can earn any more, or maybe after I get a lot of achievements or something, I'll gain more. I'm not sure, but that was right at the beginning when I earned those. So I'm not really sure if you can gain many more. You see these quests you can complete. These only give you max points 1200 max points, 100 max points. So nothing for Q points. Okay, so notes, skins cost max points. But it seems everything good costs Q points. So, this is a really fun game, and、uh, DJ Max has a history on the PSP with more Beat Mania or piano style games where the notes just fall down the screen and you tap with the buttons. Um, but then on the PS Vita, they released 
this game, basically, it's called uh, DJ Max Technica Tune on the Vita, and that's probably a much better deal. So if you are interested in this game and you have a Vita or you're planning to get a Vita at some point, I would definitely just get that game instead, even though the screen is smaller. So it is nice having this large screen, but it's such a huge app and the songs are expensive here, you know. I'd rather just buy the full game and have a lot more songs to play. It is a, a little different on Vita. They do take advantage of the back touch screen a little bit. Uh, there are some certain notes you can touch with the, use the back touch for, but you don't have to, you can disable that. I haven't played it. So I do really like this game, but I'm not gonna keep it on my iPad. This is Rhythmix, which is a direct copy of Technica, pretty much, uh, but it uses a lot of, I think, royalty-free songs, just classic songs and things. This is almost identical. Uh, it just uses slightly different colors and things, and it does not use key sounds. Or does it have music videos in the background? So this file size is much more manageable. The songs in this game are also cheaper, $3 for a pack of four songs, although maybe not as good as the music in Technica. I haven't heard any of this, so I don't know. You can preview it on here, which is nice. Sure, if Technica has these notes. I hope this video was helpful. If you'd like to buy this game, please use the link in the description or check out the Roundup page for prices and more information about all the games. It's optimized for iPhone and using my links will help me make more videos.